how to create a vivid vision. Hey, this is Mark Nelson. I'm really excited for this today. I've talked about visions before, and I think it's one of the truly best things you can do to build your business, to change your life. And I just heard this on a podcast, and I've read about it before, but I didn't pay much attention to it. But, you know, sometimes you have to hear things, you know, a couple times or read them a couple times before they start sinking in. So today what I want to do is talk to you about a vivid vision and how to create that. Now, vivid vision or a painted vision or a painted picture vision, because everybody calls it different things, but it was really what I heard it from was on a podcast, I Love Marketing, with Cameron Harold. It was just an amazing thing, and maybe it's because I was sitting in the right presence or I was listening for something to kind of helped me out in my business. See, I write vision statements before, and I thought about visions, but he did something really different. He talked about going in the future only three years, and, and what Cameron... Carol does is he really helps big companies grow. But you can do this for a small company too. So anyway, a vivid vision. What you need to do first is go out in nature and bring a notebook and a couple pens. So here's where I did mine. If you know me, I love my pontoon. I love the lake. So I went out in my pontoon with a notebook and a couple pens in case I ran out. And to create a vivid vision, what you need to do is have a foot in the presence and a foot in the future. And then you think, what if, right? Now, I kind of miss a step. Because I don't know about you, but I got my phone near me all the time. You get away from devices. And you really need to think outside the box on this. So when you get out in nature, get really quiet, get still. And then just think, three years down the future, what your business could be. What you want your business to be. How big do you want it? And I'm going to talk business here. So I sat down and went, okay, what do I want? my business to look like in three years. And I started writing. And it was really amazing because I came away with like three pages of things that I wanted. See, I want a seven figure business. I don't want to be working all the time. So I want to be able to have some people inside my business helping me. My social media, my copywriting, my ads, my funnels. I want to be the creator. And I want to find the right people that will help me in all these decisions. That's what I saw three years out. Now, I also saw three years out. While my business is doing this, Nancy and I are traveling. We're in our RV, going to different places. And every day I get on the internet. I'm going to rephrase that because not every day. You know, during my work week, I'm going to get on the internet for one to two hours. I'm going to get on some phone calls, some Zoom calls, and talk to my team. And I'm going to game plan how I can continue to make a seven-figure business. All the while encouraging my teammates to get creative in their own. To tell me what to do. So when you do your vivid vision, the biggest thing. Biggest Get outside in nature where nobody can bother you. doesn't matter if it's the woods, on the lake, in a grassy field. Just get outside. Bring your notebook, right, like a legal pad, and a couple pens. And then just relax. And then think like you're going in the future. You can do it. I did it. It was kind of fun. Just put yourself in the future three years out and think about what your business would look like. What kind of business do you want? What kind of life do you want? What kind of relationship do you want? 
all of this. Just let the ideas come flow. Now the key is when you get back with your vision, your painted vision, your vivid vision, you need to clean up your notes, write them down, but you got to share your vision. You got to let people what see what you see. You just can't keep it amongst yourself. See, many times what I've done is create a vision and nobody hears about because I'm nervous to tell people. I'm not nervous to tell people I want a seven-figure business anymore. I'm not nervous to tell people I want to put help other people create a seven-figure business. I'm not nervous to do that. So I want you to do the same thing. Get outside. Get somewhere really quiet. No devices. Bring your notebook, a couple pens. Think outside the box. And just imagine you're in the future. Only three years. Three years from today. What is your business going to look like? And write down your vivid vision. Hey, part of my vivid vision is I like to help people create courses because I really believe that's the way. One of the multi streams of income that you can make money in is creating your own info product using your knowledge. So I help people launch and create online courses. I got a great free resource called your ultimate guide to course creation. And you can find it at marknelsononline.com forward slash course creation. MarkNelsonOnline.com forward slash course creation. Hey, you take care. We will talk to you again soon.